How's it going everybody? This is Beat the Bush. Today, we're gonna go eat some KFC hot wings and I'm gonna show you how to order it so that you get the freshest and crispiest hot wings. You might think, oh KFC, it's just fast food. Everybody can go order it and everybody will get the same thing. The truth is, for any fast food restaurant, you can order in a special way so that they make it fresh right there. Let me show you how to do this. Now, a lot of people don't realize this, but you can actually order from KFC and ask them to make it fresh for you. I know a lot of those KFC workers, they're gonna be like, oh my gosh, I hate this guy because it's gonna make more work for you guys. When someone orders something fresh, I don't think they exactly have to do it, so you gotta ask nicely. I will go order 20 pieces, uh, just so that it'll make it worth their while. When you buy more of them, you actually get kind of like a quantity discount, and they usually run about 75 cents each. Uh, of course, I also get large mashed potatoes with it, so you can dip them in to the hot wings. And I don't know, I'm kind of a foodie myself, and liking these hot wings, even though, you know, it's a fast food restaurant, is says something, because they're doing something right. So here we are at your typical KFC. Nothing new here. Any KFC looks like this. Let's go in. So I got the wings ordered. They usually say about 10 minutes and I ordered so many times that before they used to say about eight minutes. So I think when they put it in, they actually fry it for exactly eight minutes and maybe they add two minutes these days saying, you know, to prepare the wings, put it in the box or whatnot. But uh, let's wait. I happily wait for this because it turns out so much better. It's like a world of difference versus the ones that's been sitting in their little heater thing. It just gets kind of mushy. It's not as crunchy. Uh, it's not as hot. Time is of the essence when you get this box of hot wings. There's 20 of them in here. Check this out. This is fresh off the fryer. You can see it's steaming. Preferably, you gotta eat this within maybe 10, 15 minutes before it cools down. Here's the hot wing. Super duper hot. Bite off a little bit. And at this point, it's so hot. All the oils and stuff, they're like liquid. It's very juicy. Mmm, so good. I'm gonna put this with some hot sauce on. And you eat that. And then I got my mashed potatoes, and it's all too hot to touch actually. And you dip it into the mashed potatoes with the gravy. Look at this. Mmm. And sometimes you don't have a spoon, so you just use the drumstick like this to grab your mashed potatoes. Of course, it's too hot to eat like this. The mashed potato is way too hot. See how hot it is? Oh my gosh. It's really good when it's steaming hot like this. This actually works better on the mid joint, so let me bite off a bit of this. And put your hot sauce on there. Now for the dip. Let me guarantee you that eating it this way is actually better than most fancy restaurants fried chicken. So this is, you know, as good as it gets completely really freshly fried it's completely crunchy the inside is done well it's tender tasty when i was waiting for these chicken wings i was looking at the nutritional content on the wall and it's actually 70 freaking calories for each one i eat about 10 11 of them so it's about a 700 calorie meal yeah not not too bad so i hope you enjoyed this little trick at kfc i'm gonna finish eating the rest of these chicken wings in a hurry don't forget to give me a like on this video comment down below let me know if you already do this little trick where you ask them to fry them fresh and don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching